This is the first in my COVID-19 and NFL football series. Obviously, I've been talking for some time about college football and COVID-19. The NFL, to which credit, had a pretty clean run until very recently. Obviously, we had A.J. Terrell of the Falcons, but he was a, a single positive test, and now we've had multiple positive tests with the Titans, forcing the first postponement of the season. The silver lining is it's happening prior to when they would have normally had scheduled bye weeks. The concern now is if this happens and happens later in the season after buys have already happened, either you have to extend the length of the season or you end up losing a game altogether. And so we may have some teams that have played more games than others. The fact is the NFL will do everything within its power to play 16 games. They want to fulfill their television contracts, but the fact also is that no one knows what the future holds. Green Bay, Wisconsin is an NFL city, and they are in a crisis in terms of their hospital capacity. That's obviously an NFL city that has been hit very hard recently by COVID-19. We are now on the edges of what they call the quote-unquote second wave. So I would urge anyone who really, really, really cares about football to be very, very careful. And anyone obviously associated with an NFL team, I hope they will take to heart this opportunity to give the season a chance. I will continue to report on this as more comes in.